we're going to look at how to change the needle on your sewing machine. There are two key items that we need. First is this tool that comes with the sewing machine. It's a very small Allen wrench with the red handle. This is used to remove and loosen the needle. The second thing you'll need is the needle that you will be replacing uh, the current one in the machine that we are changing out. First, we're going to talk about where we loosen the needle from. We're going to take our Allen wrench in our hand, and if we come down and we look at our needle shaft and where the needle is, there is a hole right here on the side of the needle bar. You'll know that it's all the way in when we can put that in there and it stays in place. To remove the needle, we're going to simply do a counterclockwise turn, and we're going to do so by just grabbing the needle and then lightly Again, reversing that set screw. We do not need to take the set screw all the way out. Simply loosen it. That will allow us to pull the needle down and out of the machine. Now that we've removed the needle, we're ready to take a new needle and position it back in the needle bar. Be sure to identify the front and the back of the needle. They are very different and the needle does need to be installed correctly in order for the stitches to work and the thread to catch on both the top and the bottom. So again, look at the needle and identify what is front and what is back. What we'll do now is we're going to take the needle. I like to take the tip of the needle, put it in between or down in the foot, and then simply with my fingers pinch this and put this up into the needle shaft. Again, we do want to make sure that this is all the way up and that it is not partially out, but is fully inserted up into the needle bar. Once it has been inserted again, confirming that we do have the needle facing the correct direction, we're going to take our little Allen tool again, put it into our set screw, and with the clockwise motion, go ahead and just tighten that back up, confirming again that the needle is all the way in, and that it is facing the correct direction, allowing us to appropriately thread that so that the machine will pick up the bobbin and the top thread so that we end up with the correct stitch.